from the Sony Pictures Studio, this is Jeopardy! Thank you, Johnny. Welcome to Jeopardy! We've got a great game lined up for you. Here are the categories for the Jeopardy! round. Before and after. Science. Counties by state. New music. Literature. And the final category. Unusual TV characters. Player one, what'll it be? It's any tissue that contracts and relaxes, causing movement of the limbs and other body parts. Player one. You're correct. Some consider ginger superior to Dramamine in preventing symptoms of this. Player two. Well done, yes. Your choice, player two. Let's do counties by state for 100. Skagit, Skamania, Spokane. Player one. Definitely. Player one, your turn. This substance to watch for on your car is basically hydrated ferric oxide. Player one? Yes, indeed. This stimulant found in coffee can ease headaches by constricting blood vessels. Player one. Ooh, sorry. Player three. Definitely. Player three, what will it be? New music? For 100, Alex? In 1965, James Brown sang that Papa's got one of these. Player one? Yes, indeed. Player one, what'll it be? The addition of chromium to this alloy makes it extra strong and stainless. Player one. Definitely. In Excess was feeling one of these in a 1988 top 10 hit. Player one. That's it.
Her hits in the 1980s included Angel of the Morning and Queen of Hearts. Player two. You're correct. Player two. Unusual TV characters. For 100. As Jonathan on Highway to Heaven, Michael Landon was one of these beings on probation. Player one. You got it. Your choice, player one. This team group is abbreviated NKOTB. Player one. You're correct. This green green group once had Kenny Rogers in it. Player three. You got it. Player three, it's your turn. I'll take literature for 100. In the Anderson tale, at age 15, she swims to the ocean surface and views the world above for the first time. Player one. You're correct. Player one, what'll it be? As Jeannie in I Dream of Jeannie, she could blink you back to Baghdad in the blink of an eye. He played the six million dollar man. Nobody? Player two. Good answer, but sorry, that's wrong. Lisa is the name of the computer-generated woman in the USA TV series based on this weird John Hughes film. Player one. Yes, indeed. Herman and Lily were the monstrous parents on this sitcom. Player two. That's right. Your choice, player two. Before and after, for 100. A. A. Milne boy who stole from the rich to give to the poor. Player one.
Ooh, no, sorry. Player two. That's it. Before and after. For 200, Alex. Popular sax playing war action figure. Player two. Exactly. Before and after. For 300. Instructor's favorite West End girls group. Player three. That's right. If you would, player three. Counties by state. For 200, please, Alex. Rockingham, Rappahannock, Roanoke. Player two. You got it. It's your turn, player two. Before and after. For 400, please, Alex. Exclamation point, who played Luke Skywalker. Player two. Definitely. Before and after. For 500, please, Alex. Dog patch resident who claims to have invented baseball. Player three. That's right. Player three, it's your turn. Literature. For 200, Alex. In this H.G. Wells novel, the first Martian spaceship lands near the town of Woken. Player two. That's it. Your choice, player two. Counties by state. For 300, Alex. Leah, Luna, Los Alamos. Player one. Oh, regrettably, no. Let's try literature for 300, Alex. Tom Canty, born in a slum called Offal Court, and Edward Tudor are the title characters in this Twain novel. I'd like counties by state for 400, Alex. Saluda, Spartanburg, Sumter. Player two? Exactly. Counties by state for 500. Answer, the Daily Double. Player two, your wager, please. Seneca, Summit, Sandusky. Player two. You got it. Literature. For 400? 
In this Orwell novel, Mr. Charrington, who runs an antique shop, is actually a member of the Thought Police. Player one. Definitely. And to finish off this round. He wrote Brave New World. Nobody. Let's take a look and see how everyone's doing after the Jeopardy round. You're in the lead, player two. Player one, you're not far off the lead now. You're in last place, player three, but you get to start things off in double jeopardy. It's time for the double jeopardy round. Dollar values double, and we have two daily doubles for you on the board. Let's see if you like these categories in the double jeopardy round. Hodgepodge, the Chicago Bulls, taking your cue, celebrity astrology, shall we dance? And here's the last category to serve. Player three, what will it be? Taking your cue. For 200, please, Alex. As this substance is denser than the human body, you may drown in it, but you won't sink. Player one. Exactly. Your choice, player one. In the 1980s, the Supreme Court approved the use of these in hiring to remedy past discrimination. Player three. That's right. Okay, player three. Celebrity astrology. For 200, Alex. Little Richard and Rich Little were both born under this sign of the archer. Player one. Ooh, no, sorry. Shall we dance? For 200, please, Alex. The dance that was performed to music like that heard here was popularized in this European capital in the 1830s. Player one. Nice try, but that is incorrect. Player three. You got it. How about Shall We Dance? For 400, please. 
It's the famous forbidden dance performed to the music heard here. Player one. Right you are. Player one, your turn. This famous line dance, performed to the music heard here, features a step-step-step kick rhythm. It's the popular trotting dance, done in 4-4 time to the music like that heard here. Player one. That's it. From words meaning song, dance, and skill, kabuki is a theatrical form of dance in this country. Player one. Yes, indeed. Answer, the Daily Double. Player one, please make your wager. For convicted British traders of yore, this procedure followed drawing. Player one. That's incorrect. This Marquis, who wrote a set of boxing rules, also helped bring down Oscar Wilde. Player three. That's right. Player three, it's your turn. I'll try taking your cue for 1,000, Alex. Answer, the Daily Double. Player three, could we have your wager, please?
Some of these objects are the size of one solar system, but brighter than a thousand galaxies. Player three. You got it. Give me hodgepodge for 200, Alex. The Papuan languages spoken in the area centered on this new island number about 700. Player three. Yes. Hodgepodge. For 400, please. It's the U.S. political party associated with the donkey symbol. Player two. Well done, yes. It's your turn, player two. How about hodgepodge? For 600, please, Alex. Dublin-born Brenda Fricker won an Oscar for playing Daniel Day-Lewis's mother in this 1989 film. Let's try the Chicago Bolt for 200, Alex. I never doubted myself, the Chicago Bulls star said, after his title-winning jump shot in 1998. Player three. That's right. Player three, what will it be? The Chicago Bulls. For 400, Alex. In 1991, Scottie Pippen's defense on Magic Johnson helped the Bulls beat this team for their first title. Player three. Well done, yes. Let's try the Chicago Bulls for 600. This colorful rebounding champ was an airport janitor when he began playing organized basketball. Player one. That's it. Player one, what'll it be? From the Japanese for empty hand, this martial art uses no weapons. Player three? Yes, indeed. Okay, player three. The Chicago Bulls. For 800, please, Alex. John Paxson clinched the title for the Bulls in 1993 with one of these shots instituted in the 1979-80 season. How about hodgepodge for 1,000, Alex? On July 10th, 1991, sanctions imposed on this African country were lifted, allowing legal U.S. trade. Player three. That's it. The Chicago Bulls. For 1,000, Alex. Artis Gilmore, a star for Chicago at this position, twice started the All-Star game against Kareem. Player three? Definitely. To serve. 
for 200, please. You can serve your leftovers directly from this brand of tight sealing food containers introduced in 1945. Player one. Exactly. Player one, your turn. According to their Buffalo, New York inventors, Buffalo wings should be served with celery and this salad dressing. Player one. Ooh, sorry. Player two? Yes. Player two? To serve? For 600, Alex. According to Guinness, this sport's fastest serve was 142 miles per hour in 1997. Player one. You're correct. Player one. He served in the Dodger organization for 47 years, retired, and returned as general manager in 1998. The To Serve Man episode of this Rod Serling TV series involved aliens with a taste for humans. Anybody? People born under this fishy sign, like Tommy Toon, are often slim and make excellent dancers. Player one. You got it. David Copperfield and Claudia Schiffer must have a lot in common. They share this maidenly sign. Anyone at all? Roger Ebert is a Gemini, and this former partner was an Aquarius. Hmm, their signs are supposed to be compatible. Player one. Right you are. And the final answer of the round. Sissy Spacek was born on Christmas Day, so this is her sign. Player one. That's right. That's the end of the double jeopardy round. Let's check out the scores. You've got the lead going into final jeopardy, player three. Player two, you're not too far off the lead. Player one, hang in there. It's still anyone's game.
right, now it's time for Final Jeopardy. I'll show you the category and give you a few seconds to think about your wager. Here's the Final Jeopardy category. The Western U.S. Player one, please make your wager. Player two, your wager, please. Player three, could we have your wager, please? This California city's official seal depicts a phoenix and a motto in Spanish, gold in peace, iron in war. Player one. Player two. Player three. Well, how did everyone manage with that clue? Player one, your question? That's right. And your wager was? Player two, your question. Sorry, that's incorrect. How much did it cost you? Player three, your question. Sorry, that's wrong. How much did it cost you? Let's hear it for our winner, player three. Thank you so much for playing Jeopardy. Bye for now.